take care of the, uh, after we take care of Rex's quest. Trust me, it's very important that we do Rex's quest first. Okay, Argus Row. Very slowly. Let's see, which one is Argus Row? I used to have all these semi-memorized. Over there, is it? Nope. I'll be back when I find it. I found it! It's the Pinnacle Station Cluster. I don't know why I unpaused already. I, I guess to show you this. Yeah, that'll be my excuse. I like snow. Okay, now, I'll be back when I find the planet. Yeah, screw it, it's only gonna take a couple more seconds. Commander, urgent message from Alliance Command coming in. I'll patch it through. Good thing I didn't check, I didn't cut out. Packet from Alliance Command. We've got a situation here, and you're the only one that can handle it. Usually. What do you need, Admiral? There's an Alliance training ground where we test weapons and technology and live fire simulations. One of the VIs we use to simulate enemy tactics in the drills is no longer responding to our override commands. It's gone rogue. This is a very important one. Just tell me how to stop it, Admiral. We need you to fight your way through the training ground of the VI Corps and manually disable it. Also shockingly difficult. Don't worry, Admiral. I'll take that thing out. I know Spectre's answered the Council, but you're still human. You're still part of the Alliance military. And right now, we need you. The VI controls all the facilities, weapons, drones, and automated defenses. You're the only one that can pull this off, Shepard. Good luck. Huh, what? Sorry, I was staring at my enormous nose. Just got lost in there. This one? Yeah, that, um... That, that one's real important, because, uh... I'll just explain when we get to it. Now... Hmm... Let's go with Rex and Tali. I gotta take Rex anyway, but... This might be the planet? I hope. Now, open the map. I gotta go... with survey. I've been here before? I'm gonna guess it's... Uh, north. I think I'm on the wrong planet. If so, just consider this a bonus. Yeah, that, that's how you, that, that's what you can call it, and definitely not a waste of time. E. Okay, yeah, this, at the very least, this is not the right location. But we're almost there anyway, so... We either get there or fall, I'm not leaving. Free money and or XP. Why do we need to play a minigame for this? I don't know. Got 50 XP. And 2700 bucks. I can dig it. I don't know, there's something about this planet that I just like the look of. Like, it, it looks it looks like the perfect hellish wasteland. You know what I mean? Uh... I, yeah, this is definitely the wrong, the wrong place. Maybe the transponder signal. I'm, I'm gonna check the transponder signal, if it's not that, then, uh... I'll let you know when I find the next planet to look at. In fact, I'm just gonna cut out the drive. And we are at the transponder. And yeah, I remember this place now. This is where we got ambushed by Geth. I don't know why that just exploded. 
So uh, I'll let you know when we find the next planet. Okay, I didn't quite, uh, didn't quite, didn't quite find the planet that we're supposed to be on yet, but I figured I should show you these sur these survey areas. Uh, Evanok, Tashi, and this one is hidden. You just gotta like scroll over it. Ooh, Prothean data disk. During a scan of the Phoenix system asteroid field, you detect you detected an odd energy reading that Tali determined was quarian in nature. She led a recon team into the asteroid field where she discovered an abandoned fighter. The team could not determine why the ship was there, but they did find a Prothean data disk on board. I think that might be, that might be what we needed for Tali's quest. Like, we, we just gotta go talk to her about it. Also, yeah, it's a good habit, too, if you're if you're not sure about... I already checked that one. If you're not sure about uh, any kind of, like, hidden asteroids or something, just, ho just hover over the asteroid belt and go in a circle. It won't take as long as you think it will. Here we go. Yeah, this is the one. I recognize this place. I'm surprised these drops don't kill us. Well, kill everybody but Rex. Now let's see. Ah. It's dead south. Obviously I'm gonna be saving before we enter because uh, it's actually been a little while. I should probably cut the drive out, but, uh... Eh? You can suffer with me. And my lift, apparently. here somewhere. I don't know how he knows that, but okay. Uh, if memory serves, it's up top. Again. Why does that happen so much? There's three of us. Damn it. As I, as it, as the meta gel uh, clicked off. Let's try that again. Seriously, why the hell am I poisoned? I should have been healed when we went back to the Normandy. This is the place. My armor's here, so... Let's try that again without the dying. I'm gonna go ahead and pop this now. Shooting Rex. Go, go, go. Also, uh, what you just saw Rex do, um, he's the only member of the party who, when, uh, ow, 
Rex is the only member of the party who, when he um, does a melee attack, oh shit. When he does a melee attack, he doesn't, um, he, he doesn't, like, use an elbow bash. Enemy is everywhere! Anyway, he does a Krogan headbutt. Kill him. Oh, you're dead. Enemy is oh, everywhere. Coming up at any second now. Enemy is everywhere. There we go. Man, those guys hit hard. I'm okay. As soon as a uh, medjo comes back up, I'm gonna use it to stop the heartbeat. Yeah, admittedly, we're kind of horrendously undergeared. Because <laughs> I haven't been buying anything and haven't really been going out of my way for uh, equipment. Ooh, polonium rounds. A weird techno thrash metal. This is it. I can't believe my ancestors ever wore this piece of crap, but at least I've got it back. I'm glad we could help you get it back. I might just be starting to like you, Shepard. Rex touches his grandfather's armor. His expiration... Expiration... His expression... Thoughtful, perhaps? No, for an slip. Broken or hard to read. Then he shakes off. No, apparently they're very hard to read. I can't even read the words. Then he shakes off his amusement and grips his gun with renewed purpose. Time to move on. And now we gotta go talk to Rex. I'll see you back on the ship. Welcome back. Shepard. You must have family other than no. your father. Now that I have my family's armor again, there's nothing left for me. So long, Rex. Shepard. We can officially can we can officially consider that done. Now let's see if uh, that disc we found is what Tali wanted. Shepherd, you need something? I want to know more about the pilgrimage. When Mike? I think we already went through all that. Like what? Looks like it wasn't. Damn it. Oh well. I guess I'll have to look that up later. Uh, I'm gonna try to do some shopping with this guy, and uh, then we're gonna move on to. Yeah, I think it's time to do Burmeyer. Go straight to Burmeyer. And die many times, because we are grossly under-equipped for it. <sighs> See you then. So, here we are. Welcome to the Soul System. And do a quick look around. Anything anomalous? No. Poor, poor Pluto. So, why are we near Earth. Well, we actually have no interest in Earth. The VI that we're going after is on the moon. This is every bit as awesome as you think it will be. Let's just go with the appropriate ones. since I use them. Yeah. There it is. West, southwest. Now, one of the things that you probably know about the moon is that it has very low gravity. That is somewhat in effect here. It's not to the same extent as that, uh, that one asteroid thing on, um, in, in Andromeda, where it really is straight up moon gravity and it's awesome. But this is still pretty cool. Also, you, uh. There it is!
guys. Ah, what a lovely JPEG of Earth. This this might take me a minute. I'll let, I'll come back when we're at the facility. Well, before we can get to the facility, I've actually been bounced so off track trying to go up this mountain that we found the debris. The CCCP Luna 23. If that's a real probe, I don't know. I am not a moon aficionado. If it is, then I have to question why it's packed with cryogenic explosives. I have found the base. The uh, reason that I jump back in so quickly is, uh, you see those red dot, those red dots? Yeah, this um, this place is armored up. One of the few sections where you actually have to pay attention with the with the Mako, or you might die. Simply because these turrets hit really, really hard. there are three of these yeah this um this will take a while i'm also going to save because not only will it take a while it's actually very dangerous in there let me just pause for a second so i can check the time all right we're all good hey unlock this shit There we go. And yeah, as you can see, um, I bought new armor. It's way better than what I was wearing. In fact, do you see how much? Do you see how high the shields are? I actually took the, I actually took the shield battery that I had off and replaced it with a first aid package. I can't remember what it's called exactly, but um, I now regenerate two hit points a second. Yeah. See what I mean about this place being dangerous? I should have saved inside. Let's try that again with a little less suck this time. I'll stay right here. Oh, don't stay right there, follow me! Idiots. If this keeps up, I might actually have to turn the difficulty down. Because these guys are just plowing through me. Ashley, why do you have a sniper rifle out? Like, I get why Caden is using a the crappy pistol, but you have a you have an assault rifle. Use it. Why aren't you using it? You're standing there eating rounds. I've lost shields. God, I'm having trouble just killing one of them. They don't, they don't pay me enough for this. And by that I mean, they don't pay me. Uh oh. Oh shit. Good luck, Ash. And Caden. They'll be fine. Oh. Apparently they really will. I forgot that they're teleporters. Yeah, I'm just gonna cheese this out for a while. I'll let you know when I'm done. That went better than expected. That's it. Bag em and tag em. Only took about another 30-some seconds. 
I'm gonna save because um yeah they kicked the shit out of us and uh we have two more hubs to go. In fact, we might not even be done with this one. Apparently, Caden needs a better pistol. A much better pistol. The first aid interface three. Only thing they really got is shield mod. Only thing they really gave us was shield modulators. I guess Caden needs that the most, because, well, he's basically made of paper. Eh, uh, yeah, I didn't think so. Honestly, I need the heat absorption. This thing cannot fire very often. Eh, we'll just stick with these. For some reason, the incendiary rounds don't cause you to build up any heat. Weird. I'm gonna save again because I'm paranoid. Poison. Oh, because I don't go through enough of that shit. I'm somehow hurting myself doing that. Man, this is so much nicer than the last evil AI overlord that uh, that I had to fight. Shodan would not shut the fuck up. <laughs> Why did you walk right in front of me, you idiot? Damn it, Reynolds! And we got a codex entry for reasons. Whatever. I'll see you at the, at the next port. And we are back. I think we're good, Commander. You are wrong, Caden. Now I don't think that there's um. Never mind. Okay, I, I I'm pretty sure that the one we did was the second hardest. There's another one that has rocket drones. That one's the hardest. And I think that's one right there. Good luck, guys. And you can take them. Or not. You coward. You stole my idea. I've lost shields. I'm just gonna keep cowering this out. I'm guessing you guys probably don't want to see it, so uh, I'm gonna pause and be right back. Well, that wasn't so bad. The, the main problem was one of the rocket drones started camping right there. Yeah, that um, that got a little awkward. But they're dead now, so who cares? And more importantly, we leveled up, which we will take care of later. I can live one sec. Okay, good. The reason, uh, the reason I just rechecked that is because I forgot to check how much money we have. We actually are about um, halfway to getting the shotgun that I want. The Spectre Grade 1. Yeah, th this is where things get a little bit irritating. It, it doesn't actually stop you from damaging it. As you can see, it doesn't even fully cover it. 
It's just a minor annoyance slightly in the way, and that's already dead. This is the real annoying one, that they put the shields in the doorways. All of them. I think once you take, uh, I think once you take down the last of these conduits, that the shields go away on their own? Question mark. for the double pausing. Uh, one of the dogs yelped, and, um, there's a hole, there, there's a hole on a blanket that we have covering the couch. Just big enough for them to fit their head through. I was worried that he might be hanging himself, so, uh, I had to go check that. Uh, he was fine, don't worry. Not really sure what the yelping was. Kind of, kind of concerned. shouldn't have even bothered coming back yet, just jump right to the next thing. Oh well. And we are back at the final cluster. And apparently I was wrong, these shields aren't going anywhere anytime soon. They're really annoying. Oh ho! Oh, it's not as good as the one I'm wearing. Ashley could use it. It's just an upgrade to what she already wears, her weird med pack looking thing. Seriously, what the hell is that? Aside from horror. I'll check I should check to see if that shotgun's any better. It is way better, oh yeah. In fact, it's so much better that I feel I should save before continuing. Well, this is going to be more of the same, so I'm going to pause it to spare you guys the pain. I just wanted to show you a glitch that happened. <laughs> also, I was wrong. This is very much not more of the same. These guys are badass and smart enough to use doors. Or maybe my companions are just too stupid to, to, to leave them closed. This will take a while. I'm better I think we now. got him, Commander. <sighs> that took me four tries, and even then, I'm not gonna lie, I had to drop it down to casual. One of just one hit from those rockets killed me outright. And even on casual, it put me down to maybe ten health from max and full shields and barrier. Yeah, the, the problem with the rockets is they basically, they do damage to your shields and barrier, but they pretty much ignore them in the process. Like, the damage to your health and to your barrier are two separate, they're, they're two separate numbers. I'm not really sure why. Uh... Honestly, I'm gonna be keeping the, um... How did you guys heal? Hayden, how are you healing? Huh, maybe that's a damage... No, damage. Maybe that's a difficulty thing. Anyway, I'm gonna be leaving it on casual for the rest of the playthrough, just cause... Jesus Christ, is this a slog on anything but... For Mass Effects 2 and 3, I will be... I will be going back up to, um... To normal. Just because I'm way better at those games. But for the rest of Mass Effect 1, it, it, if, if the lower difficulty somehow upsets you to the point of, like, rage, you can go, so, you, you can go watch someone else's play through that. 
I really don't think it's that big of a deal. Okay, here we go. A burst of white noise over all frequencies nearly deafens you. Your hard suit heads up display interprets it into a series of zeros and ones. I'm not gonna read out the zeros and ones. Uh, obviously, this is this is binary. I looked up what it meant once, but I can't remember. I think it's like a call for help. They repeat again and again, blanketing all frequencies until the lights on the final BI, BI cluster flicker and die. And now the entire reason we went through this hell, specialization class achieved. Your specialization class will, repl will replace your base class in the talents on the squad screen. Talent ranks in your base class transfer over to your specialization class. Go to the squad screen to view the bonuses you gain with each rank in your specialization class. We can take either Shock Trooper or Nemesis. Hmm. Honestly, Shock Trooper is just way better for me. Because the only thing that I the only thing I really use is barrier. And um yeah, health and damage protection would be desperately needed. A quick warning though. Quick, quick warning, though. Ah, there it is. Once, once you make your decision on your specialization class, it cannot be changed. This includes on repeat playthroughs. If you do a new game plus and you do this mission again, you will not get the option to change your specialization class. Be warned. Anyway, I'm going to start dumping points into that like there's no tomorrow. Looks like we'll get barrier specialization at, uh, level 30? Maybe? And we got a whole bunch more stuff that I'm probably just gonna sell. I will see you back on the Normandy.